Welcome back, folks. Are you better be raped by some more Stone Prophet? Did I say raped? I meant watch some more Stone Prophet. Excuse me. That's my bad. Are you ready to be raped in every orifice by Octopot? You pick up a shield. Is the shield worth the shit, though, is the question. Uh, bring in protection. Let's also identify that. Uh, anything else? Shield, bonus, my dick. Give him hammer and shield combination for now. You know what? I hate quarter staffs. Give him the plus two war hammer. Dagger of throwing is plus two. Ring of protection is plus one. Ah! Which is why he's got this other ring of protection. I'm going to give the ring of regeneration to my cleric, actually. Now, why isn't he using the warhammer? It's a cleric. Clerics have used war hammers. What's going on here? Oh god, another piece of dog shit limited, limited with this bullshit. Oh god. You know what? Fuck the shield then. What the fuck can you use? Really? Quarterstaffs, that's it? That's awesome. I'm glad I picked you up, you dick licker. Why the fuck can't a ranger cleric use a warhammer? Clerics are supposed to be able to use any bludgeoning weapon. <gasps> what the fuck else is back here? I must be missing something. You guys go ahead and comment and let me know what I'm missing. Kind of similar. keys and drop them somewhere safe. I wish I had one more key ring. Be nice. I hate dropping keys, god damn it. I don't care if I don't need them. You never know. A padded helm. I happen to know this is a very nice padded helm. It's a plus two padded helm, in fact. Gonna give that to Trajan Cat. Who no longer needs the Elven Helm. I 
the Elven Helm may look prettier, but it certainly doesn't drop the armor class minus two. By the way, asshole, that hurt. It's time to head into the south. Ah. South to okay. There we are. All right, water for everyone. <laughs> Drink up. A sarcophagus and nothing more. Oh, here's a hero font seal quarter. Let's bust out the bag of holding and see if we can find the box with it. Need one more for each piece. Pretty much what we came down here for. Time to wrap this dungeon up, B. Thorn key is pretty much all you need from this area. Put the thorn key in this hole here. Opens up this teleporter. The path to judgment awaits us all. Wait no longer. Step forward and brave our judgment. The guardian of the gate of the dead longs to can meet my ass. Whoa. Welcome. 
Welcome all who come to me. The gate of the dead awaits. I am its guardian. Please, no need to bow. Let caution vanish from your eyes. I stand here, ready, waiting only to judge the worth of your souls. Come, request my judgment. No need to hesitate. Judgment is not a word I take lightly. What sentence would you pass? What word do you seek? The gate of the dead awaits. Is it not your wish to speak with the spirits in the netherworld? With the souls of those who have gone before? That is the sentence I would pass. It is the only judgment mine to make. The old beliefs, do you know them? Deeds of good weighed against those of bad? I have every confidence your good acts while in Harakir shall allow you passage. Shall we see? Hmm. How dangerous could such a judgment compare to all we've seen in Harakir? Yes. Judge us quickly and open the gate of the Judge camp. you. Yes, and quickly. The good against the bad. I weigh them both even as we speak. Hear me then. For your deeds of selfishness and deceit outweigh the good. You may not pass. I am sorry. You have broken my heart. Please, go and work good in Harakir. The deeds are there. The opportunities await. It requires only a spirit of sacrifice. The day shall come when you seek my judgment in confidence and joy. The spirits of the netherworld await you. Can you tell us of our actions in Harakir have been held in the balance? On what evidence has this judgment been made? Do you not know? Truly? Search your heart, for the answer is there, more clearly than my words. Still, if you wish, those actions of kindness and generosity weighed in my judgment are these. Even in this place, I heard her thanks, the joy of the young girl you helped return home. The tears of her father echo in my heart, tears of joy. With such care, you escorted the injured woman back to Muhar. How might she have survived, if not for your kind attentions? The dagger of the Vistani woman did not belong to you. Recognizing this, you returned it to her brother. His thanks weigh in your favor. At your side, the blind seer fulfilled her destiny. What greater aid could you have offered any in Harakir? You, who speak with animals, I know of a contract made with a small creature. Only those whose honor shines more brightly than the sun would keep such a bargain, honoring the wishes of a cat. At the Temple of Harvest, an old priest has seen the glory of the ages restored. Those actions of selfishness and deceit weighed in my judgment are these. When presented with wishes of Pharaoh might envy, you chose to help only yourself. So cold the spirit within you, so small. Is there no room to warm a beggar's heart? How small your courage! That weakness of will by which you avoid sentiment? In aiding the undead paladin, you might have returned a sense of honor to Harakir. If only... So she tells of us those two things. One we're going to go rectify now. Uh, but yeah, basically you have to do good in Harakir to leave the land. Now that we have the 
seal, we can return to the Sphinx. Uh, we'll go ahead and put the keys here, actually. They might stay here, they might not. God damn it. Either way, I don't think we'll need them any longer. But this is pretty much the exit of the game. So we'll leave the keys there where we know where they're at. the cup. There, we've offered the calcite wishing cup to the statue. Now let's see if it makes a difference. Well met and thank you. The difference has been made. The cup is one of wishes and that which you offer to me I give freely back. Desires, yearnings, and hopes. You know them all. Every so often, fortune smiles on those who want as easily as it rewards those who try. From among these wishes, you may choose. To forever slake your thirst while you roam the sands of Harakir. To grant you protection from fires both mortal and magical, though the heat of the wall of Ra no magic can erase. To provide an immunity to poisons, one which shall end only when you rest far from the deadly venoms of our land. To grant health and fortune upon one fated to live apart from his kind. To bring acceptance to one who has known only the rejection of his people. 
All right, so choice one, of course, you never need water again. Choice two, grant you immunity to fire. Choice three, three grant you immunity to poison. And choice four, of course, is the right decision. And that helps out, uh, gives you another judgment point in favor of you leaving Harakir. You have chosen the most difficult of wishes, but I will gladly work my magic. Labor to exhaustion in this great cause. Depart with my blessing and know that somewhere a life has been transformed and fortune smiles upon One who's only known pain, okay. Not reaction, it's difficult to tell whether or not we made the correct choice. There was a correct choice. I suppose as it is so often does, time will tell the tale. shit out. Alright, it's time to head to the buried temple of Ra. Wanna check something real quick. Still not there. Oh well. Monsters about. Oh, okay. Well, now it's time to head over to the buried temple of Ra. Which should be due south of here. teleport key. He's gone up a level for sure. And so is she.
pretty sure it's around here. Actually, what I think we'll do first is we'll put cement to rest. We can always pick up a different party member. the paladin isn't helping out all that much. Let's put her to rest. Who's this bitch? Come you here to worship before set? Let me see your eyes. Look to me now, that I may divine what secrets, jealousy, and evil await. But you are not here for set. No, nor to cherish my words. I... I cannot bear to think what brings you here. Curiosity and fate. They seem to lead us everywhere. Who are you? Search your mind. The sound of my name is yet fresh within. Isu, Isu Rekotep. I am the teacher of which. Perhaps we've heard of you. Lies, slanders, half truths. It is Osiris who enslaves us through his blind devotion to the good. Where is the freedom of power if not with Set? Forgive us if we are not familiar with the ways of Set. How came you to devote yourself to this god of evil? God of evil? I take it Sin Met is a greater mummy, one who has once obeyed the will of Octopod. What became of him? Oh, he is no more. No, believe you this, if you believe anything. Sin Met is no more. Once a devoted priest, his service to Octopod went unrewarded. Indeed, by Unctopot's orders, Senmet was put to death. Such a waste for one so suited to rule, so more fitted to the throne of Harakir than Unctopot himself. If I awakened him, if I brought this mummy's guise to life to walk the land, it was to search out a vengeance befitting his terrible fate. Dangerous vocation controlling a greater mummy. What did you hope to accomplish? By set, I desired the common desire that only the uncommon achieve. The power to command. The power to rule. The mummy senate was but the beginning. For in time, all of Harakir was to be mine. Together we would take from Octopat the foolish, Octopot the weak. We would take what must in the end be ours. Yet Senmet is no more. My Senmet, my great and glorious servant, is no more. If I were to curse with the greatest of curses, a curse to envelop and destroy, I would level it upon all who seek to do Senmet. Hard. I'm gonna kill that motherfucker. Your words are confusing. If said matters no more, then why a curse upon those who seek him harm? I curse who I please. In yeah, anyway, shut the fuck up, bitch. Pretty sure Trust her that. not. Believe not a word she says. This undead creature wants no more than to rule at any cost. Treachery and deceit drip from her smiles. Yeah, she's a cunt whisker.
Alright, the Dungeon of the Serpent. We'll see you next video, folks, as we take on Sin Mint and lay his monkey ass to rest.